Hi, my name is Asha Drake and I teach drawing and painting at the Bay School. Um, and this term is just devoted to drawing, so there's a drawing 1A and drawing 1B section. And the drawing 1A students are just getting comfortable with working on a surface with a variety of drawing materials, um, from charcoal to ink. Um, and each class, whether you're in drawing 1A or drawing B, begins with gathering around as a community of artists. Um, and the students all are keeping a, an archive of their work, um, which is their sketchbook. But the term, uh, students experimented with different materials. And then working on a self-portrait project, the 1B students got to um, combine materials that they had uh, a liking to during the term. And ink on paper for some students was, was the material that they felt most comfortable working with. Um, other students wanted to think about zooming in or zooming out or expanding their drawings and one way an artist can do this is is going very old school, going back to using the overhead projector and on a piece of transparency um, watching the drawing unfold as it's projected onto the wall space that has paper on it and just working with the spontaneity of line, um, using ink, using pen, using a sharpie um, to capture uh, their identity through the drawn form. Um, other students became more experimental in the drawing space um, and decided that once they had laid down this mapping of line working with a, with a drawing material, they wanted to add in another drawing material. So this, this exciting possibility of what happens if I use the X-Acto knife to um, embellish or reduce my drawing? Um, and how is it different standing rather than sitting while working on the, the drawing piece itself? Um, the drawing 1B students working on uh, linoleum cuts um, investigated how, again, working with a drawing on a piece of linoleum, like a big eraser essentially, and then carving into it with uh, a linoleum tool, how that felt, how that changed the quality of line and the quality of the drawing. And then students in 1A started doing self-portraits working in styrofoam and just, just becoming sensitive to different surfaces that drawing tools can work on. Um, they were very comfortable working on paper and then this different experience of drawing into the squishy um, kind of soft material of the styrofoam. Um, and, and then the, the kind of beautiful progression of making a drawing in the styrofoam and then adding color or layers of color to then reveal a print, which, which again is this bridge between drawing and painting. Hopefully by the end of the term students feel empowered to, to draw with different materials um, that, that they have gravitated towards during the term.